Hello and welcome to my kitchen. In today's video, I'll be sharing you my special recipe of making devil eggs. These are with little twist. So without wasting a time, let's check the ingredients. This past Thanksgiving, we were at my husband's family and one of the things I made was deviled eggs. Everyone loved that recipe and that's why I thought why not to share this recipe with you guys. So the first thing you will do is boil the eggs. Now I'm considering you all know how to boil your eggs so that's why I'm not going to show you how to do that. We'll start by putting some butter in a pan and let's start the heat. Once the butter melts, we are going to add chopped onion and garlic. There is a little bit garlic here. I used two cloves of garlic and some onion. This is all chopped. We will add it here. You can add garlic first and then onion or you can just add all together. It doesn't matter. And we're going to cook this for a little. Once the onion is nicely golden color, we will go ahead and add chopped mushroom or minced mushroom. I will call this minced, but you don't have to mince it. You can also just chop it. And just nicely saute it until mushroom is all cooked. Once the mushrooms are cooked, we'll add the parsley to here. This is chopped parsley. Turn down your heat. Now we'll season it. Some salt. Don't overdo it because we are going to add seasoning to the yolks too. So some pepper. And you can add any other seasoning that you wish. So this mixture is done. Let's turn off the heat. So these are eight egg yolks. I nicely grated them. To this, I'm going to add one fourth cup of mayonnaise. Now start with one fourth cup. You can always add extra. Add dash of mustard. You can also add the Dijon mustard, but I like the regular mustard for deviled eggs. So that's what I added. Again, start with the little bit. And let's mix this. Now if you're wondering what is that pink thing or red thing on the yolks, well you will see when you see the egg whites. I made some into the pink color. So that's why the yolks are also a little pink. But that's all normal. Now to this I'm going to add some black pepper. Add according to your taste. Seasoning always add according to your taste. Add some paprika. You can skip the paprika, but I like to add some paprika. And some salt. Now I use sea salt and pink salt mixture. And let's mix it all good. This is a base of any table days. To this, we are going to add the mushroom and onion mixture that we made. Just go ahead and add. Quantity, you decide how much you want to add of mushroom and onion. And let's mix it all good. The mushroom and onion gives like nice sweet taste to this. Okay, so the yolks are ready. Let's go ahead and put them in the egg whites. To get this nice pink color on the eggs, all you need to do is boil the eggs, peel them and put it in the beetroot juice for 3 to 4 hours. And there you have nice pink eggs. Now let's start piping these eggs with the mixture we just made. 
I'm going to use the piping bag, but you can just put it with the scoop or you can use a Ziploc bag, cut it in the corner and pipe it in the eggs if you don't have a piping bag. So let's start piping it. All the egg yolks are filled. Now you can garnish it however you like. I'm just gonna put simply some parsley and chives on it. 